the Galway Hurdle is next in. This is a Grade 2 2 minor. And some of the big boys from last season back for this, I think. It's Baltic Dragoon at the top for Graham Clitterbuck. Bien Glenboy for David Robertson. Brilliant Melody, Alex Cherry, Coolberg about Martin Leedham, Dominion of Darkness, Josh Musselland, Evelyn Carter, James Shea, Great Debate, Leon Van Rensburg, Greystone, Ryan Costello, Harold Humid, Darren Thompson, Morley Street, David Hooley, Sierra Messiah, Craig Allen, Up and Atom, Paul Rhodes, Another Pearl, David Hooley, Big Swizzle, Alex Cherry, Night Star, Ryan Costello, Rough Weather, Leon Van Rensburg, Seductress, Paul Rhodes, and Venaria Prince for David Robertson so one or two familiar names in there then from last season and big field for this and away they go a few races this week where you can put two in we'll be back to two entries I think next week apart from the maidens that we might have left but it's Seductress who's gone right into the early lead although brilliant Melody is now coming through on the inside as they take the first of the 11 flights and over that one it's Seductress closest to us in the green and brilliant Melody with the orange sleeves over on the far side we're going to dispute the lead then and they've already opened up by four or five lengths to the chasing pack who are headed by BN Glenboy in the turquoise and purple hoops and the purple and white stripes of Coolbeg about on the outside who won a big four year old hurdle here last season and they jump over flight number two and Seductress is the leader and brilliant Melody second David Robertson pair together, Bien Glenboy and Venaria Prince. Dominion of Darkness is also close up, calling about on the rail as they skip over flight number three, looking towards the back, Grey Stone. It's just about the back marker. It's Seductress on the outside of Brilliant Melody. They take flight number four together. And Seductress hurdled it just that little bit better than Brilliant Melody and has now gone on by about a length as they take their short run to flight number five. They're all safe now. We're looking towards the back. Alex Cherry's second run, a big swizzle, is probably just about last. Although Morley Street, you'd expect to be one of the big guns in this second time round. He's currently sitting out of the back. There's a circuit to go. And Seductress is the leader by a battle. Then to Brilliant Melody in second. Gap of two or three, then to Callback about as they get over flight number six. And the field are beginning to bunch behind these two leaders now. Still. Seductress and Brilliant Melody having a ding dong battle for the lead. Callback about. He is sitting quietly in third. The ground is outside of Sierra Messiah. Then comes Dominion of Darkness and Rough Weather. Then the David Robertson pair still together. The end Glenboy and Venaria Prince. Another Pearl is trying to come between those two. After that one is great debate. Then Big Swizzle now getting much closer. Then Harold Hewitt and Evelyn Carter's after that one. And Morley Street's going to try and slip up the inside. Night Star, Greystone and Rockman Atom are out the back. But Seductress is now being pressed by the Grey Sierra Messiah as they get over flight number seven. Seductress jumped it just the better is about a head up from in second place Sierra Messiah Brilliant Melody still there in third then comes Big Swizzle another Pearl is thrown out a big challenge around the outside as they really now begin to bunch up behind this leading pair Seductress and Sierra Messiah trying to hold them off another Pearl's come through around the outside Big Swizzle is there as well Baltic Dragoon is also come with a good looking one as they come to the third last and over fourth last and over that one they go and Sierra Messiah has now gone on it's Sierra Messiah in the lead from another Pearl in second then Coolbeg about Baltic Dragoon, great debate, wide open this one still, but Sierra Messiah will race into the final three flights over that one in the lead, it's Sierra Messiah in the lead by two, three lengths then, to another Pearl in second, great debate is third then, rough weather, Coolbeg about, just beginning to drop back a little bit, trying to get through the inside, it's Harold Human over the second, last they go, and Sierra Messiah, now being pressed by Harold Human, who's got a dream one up the inside, in comes rough weather and great debate Baltic Dragoon over the final flight, they go and Harold Human hits the front, but immediately pressed by rough weather, it's rough weather now beginning to get up on the outside, Harold Hume is trying to fight back, here comes Great Debate, it's rough weather, Harold Hume, Great Debate, racing up towards one, it's just rough weather, Harold Hume, Great Debate, another pearl after that one, and all the way back to Seductress and Oppen Atomo, the last two to finish, and an exciting finish, and Leon Van Rensburg horse just getting up to take it on the line from Harold Hume, and top class two milers in there, have some ding dong battles next season, or this season for the rest of the season I should think and the result will probably change on a weekly basis if rough weather takes it for Leon Van Rensburg Harold Humid for Darren Thompson was second great debate Leon Van Rensburg again was third Baltic Dragoon for Graham Clutterbuck was fourth and another glen um, another pearl for David Hooley was fifth